Ladies and men to gents, if the algorithm sent you this video, that means YouTube wants you to start working out. Shh, not my problem. I'm here to help you. Anyways, if you're new to this channel, my name is Joel. I go by the real Joel. I usually post updates on my hair transplant that I did in Turkey, but this week I'm going to do something different. If you watched my last video, I said I'm going to be doing a fitness sprint for the month of February. This is the last day of January and I wanna show you what that workout would look like. So if you're gonna participate, stick around. If you're not, check my other videos. <laughs> anyway, so like I said, this fitness journey is a sprint and it is in four phases. So phase one would be the first seven days. You would do the same workouts. These are five workouts. And then every other week we add, every week, sorry, we add an extra set. So at the end of the month, you would have four sets. So let me show you what the workout looks like. And apologies on the audio. I already recorded this video trying to use uh, the Movo mic on the DJI Osmo Pocket 3. Didn't work. But if you know any way I can use a uh, mic for this Osmo Pocket 3 without using the DJI mic, comment below, let me know, help me out. Okay, so here's the workout. All you need is a pull-up bar and dumbbell. I have a 30 pound dumbbell and this uh, multi-grip pull-up bar that I got on Amazon. It could cost you about 30, 40 bucks. So let's get started. First things first, you wanna do a light stretch I'm not going to go through the entire workout. I'm just going to show you every movement that I do. So I do a light stretch working from top to bottom. So shoulders, neck, waist, hips, my knees, ankles, hamstring, glutes, all that good stuff, right? First workout I like to get out of the way are the push-ups because those are the easiest for me. You want to do 10 push-ups. Push-up move, movement is easy. Um, let me just show you real quick. Shoulders, palms, with a part like that. One, two, you wanna look, you wanna be able to look at your belly button when you go down, three. That's how you know you have good form. Okay. Push up first, then I go to squats. If you don't have a dumbbell, you can just do free weight squats like that. I have a dumbbell, so <clears throat> I do a modified version. You can do this, one, two, or you can do this. And then you push up, press. So that works the legs and the shoulders. Uh, that's also kind of good cardio as well. Then after the push press or squat, I go to my pull up, pull up station. One, two, three. You can do two sets of five, however many sets you want to do, but as long as you get 10 in, you're good. Then I do my mountain climbers. One, two, three, four, five. That's the mountain climbers. Then the last workout, the last movement is crunches. So I do a modified version, you can do the easy version, but I have my legs raised the entire time. I go like that. One, two, three, four, five. So that's the workout. Those are the movements. Easy peasy. Five quick movements. Ten reps for the first week. After you pass the seven days, day eight, you add an extra set. Um, Day 15, you have add an extra set. Day 22, you add an extra set. So at the end of it, you're going to be doing four sets, um, which might be a lot for some people, but we're, you know, you're gaining momentum every week. Two things that you want to try to achieve consistency. Um, so that means you're doing it maybe every morning and you got to finish it. Once you start, you have to finish it. Once you start the workout, you have to finish the workout. So those two things, if you can get that, if you can accomplish that, you're on your way, man. Um, after day 15, you would feel bad not doing the workout. It become sort of part of your 
uh, routine. Uh, I did this last year and the benefits were obviously weight loss, but the mental clarity that I got was phenomenal. And I think that's priceless. I also felt really good, um, looked amazing. And, uh, yeah, it just, it's just, it's always a win-win. Okay. I did also incorporate some sort of diet change. I reduced the amount of processed foods that I ate, took out sugars, reduced salt. I wasn't drinking sodas, no alcohol, no dairy, but that's just my preference. Um, on Sundays and, and Thursdays, I really focused on, focused in on the diet. Um, because it's very hard for me to be disciplined, but I focused it on a diet. I tried to eat, try to go raw, raw vegan on Sundays and uh, Thursdays. And if I had to eat something cooked, it would be fish. So just salads, fruits, berries, nuts, all that stuff. No snacking at night. I just eat peanuts, walnuts, all those kind of stuff. Blueberries, uh, fruits. But join this journey and, um, you you would thank yourself after the end of, after the end of this. Plus, February is the shortest month of the year. Twenty nine days. You could do it. Anyways, if you don't like this content, you want to just stick to the hair progress content. I will be posting week um, is it week twelve, week twelve on Sunday. So stay tuned for that. A lot a lot has changed in in one week. All the issues that I went through in week eleven gone. So good news. But I have some very interesting questions to touch on. So stay tuned, all right? See you soon. Cheers.